Hello there. Um, today I want to make a video. Specifically, I've been asked by enough people, how do you make your melodies? How do you come up with that that sound? Did you play all that you know all that stuff right uh, for songs? And my answer is every time is uh, I just kind of use my ears, right? And they're just like, what the fuck does that mean? You know, like they don't understand. So. I want to do this video to explain what I'm talking about. You know, I barely use any music theory at all. I mean, I, I just know it, kind of, but not really. So, um, hopefully this video will be helpful, and I'll try to tell you how I do things and how you can get better at using your ears to make melodies. Um, so, you know, the number one thing you do need to know just going in is you got to know the difference between major and minor uh so that's this is basic as shit right so this is what major sounds like i got fl keys this is a default piano plugin major right happy uh positive not a care in the fucking world right <laughs> just had ice cream in the park okay you get it this is minor let's extend this not so happy right minor it's a little negative it's a little dramatic um, so knowing the difference between these is really important and I know it sounds simple to say oh happy and sad but it, that's really it um, there's obviously variations to this, you know, but, uh, so if you start from this point, you know, you can really go far. So I'll just let you know right now, I don't use a lot of major chords in my music. Not really. Um, yeah, I mean, maybe like passing tones or something, but n not much. Um, a lot of it's minor or if it is major, it's very R&B influenced, right? It's very there's some other stuff that I don't know but so just going off these two things with major and minor if you wanted to build a chord uh, one tool you really need to sharpen and you know learn how to do is to sing the notes right again this sounds really fucking stupid but you have to be able to where is it here we go let's just do it with this Da, 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 da. Right? Got to do it. That was fucking good. Hey, all right. Um, no, you 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 need to know how to sing the notes. Um, and I'll be honest with you, you should probably take some music theory classes, right? I probably should because there's ways, there's times where I, I'm like, fuck, you know, if only I knew this chord. But I've gotten around it and I don't need it. So anyway. You got to know how to sing pitches. And the piano roll is really helpful because it'll tell you. That's a C, right? That's an octave down C. That's 12, uh, is it semitones? Uh, yeah, semitones down is lower C. So, okay, so let's build a fucking melody here. And I'm not going to use the shitty piano anymore because I actually hate it and... I noticed that a lot of music theory videos, they they use like the worst sounding stock thing. Um, and I don't want to do that. I like my boy Wasp here. Let's get a patch going. What is that? Is that major or minor? Na 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 na. It's happy, kind of. It's not sad. What about this? Ooh, that's not happy. Right? You get it. So let me make a little patch here. Oh, you know what? It's probably going to be aliasing or whatever setting I have, but it's okay. Let's put on dual mode. Love it. Okay. So going off this whole major minor thing, I'm going to build some chords, right? And uh, you've got this you've got this piano roll, you've got this grid. You can 
you know, by uh, making a pattern and then pressing play and stopping and listening to it, you can get the feel for it. Use the metronome. The metronome's your best friend, right? So let's try to do something in major. Um, and I don't know what notes I'm going to start with. Uh, you can build a chord from the top or the bottom. So, if, for example, I'm going to go a little lower. How about this? Let me go. Mm. Oops. How about this? Okay, so that's a da da da. That's a root note and a fifth. Da da. Wait, no. What's a fifth? Shit. I think that's worth it. Whatever. Um, you don't need to know. So, okay. Got the chord there. And let's think of what should come after, you know? How about, um, how about this? This might sound like a, I might get sued for this copyright. And if it helps you, start with the root note and then build up. top and I'm just going to copy this chord here Let's just do a loop like that. So not the most interesting thing, and it kind of sounds like Bill Withers' uh, Lean On Me. Dun, 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 It does sound a lot like that, so. Bill Withers, please don't sue me. I don't have any money. Um, so you know, to start going with something, with these chords. I usually do the chords first, and then the bass line will come after, and then some type of melody, because the chords really fill out the harmonic. I mean, that's kind of what, that's what chords are, is harmony. It's multiple notes playing at once, right? And the chords really fill out the harmonic uh, spectrum of the song. I'm kind of bullshitting my words, but you know what I mean? Like, if I just had bass, you'd only hear one note at a time, and you wouldn't get the same picture. Whereas harmony, it's like, we have the roadmap for the track now, right? We know what the chords are, and then adding the bass and the melody won't be a big deal. So, uh, I have two patterns here. I don't want to step in everything all over again, so I'm going to make the second one unique. Bam. So, what do we got right now? We got bump, 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 bump. Bump. How about let's go down just to avoid that lawsuit from Bill? How about da, 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 da. that's another thing you guys sing out those chords? I didn't even mean to do that to help you guys, I just do that. Nope. 
That sounds minor. Hmm, wait a minute. See, I don't usually <laughs> do these square-ass chords. Um, uh, how about this? Why these give me trouble? Oh, I, I got. So I'm not singing. Da 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 da. There we go. See. There we go. I got a little worried there. Okay, what do we got? Da da. That doesn't sound right. That sounds better. Good enough. Okay, so we have some chords here. Not the most exciting thing, but you get it, right? You understand how I did it. I'm just singing the notes, um, and I'm thinking about the rhythm, you know. And if you have trouble with the rhythm, just you know, do something like this. Let's say screw the melody. Just go. Just start playing around like this. Maybe add some swing. And if you wanted to, you could select this, hit Control X, and then put it in here. Control V. Well, it doesn't want to do it. Oh, I see why. I'm silly. Uh, it needs to be in the piano roll first. So right click, go to piano roll, hit Control A, Control X, and then go to the pattern itself, hit Control V. And then you can build the chord with this rhythm. You see what I mean? With that C, with that pattern. Oh boy. Okay, so we've got this Bill Withers knockoff track. It's not very good, but um, so for a bass line, let's use something other than Wasp, just for the sake of your ears. Uh, and let's make this shit sound good. This sounds like ass. One sec. Uh, one sec here. Sorry for all the clicking and clacking my keyboard. I love this keyboard though. Sync that. How about wow wow? You want wow wow? Man, this is the <laughs> this is the lamest fucking. I understand why busy work beats has all these lame tracks because he's trying to teach you a concept and uh, he doesn't want to be too crazy so he's trying to dumb it down not dumb it down you know what I mean he's trying to go at a beginner's pace um, that's funny okay so for bass let's use oh god I don't know blah 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 um, Let's use Harmer. Where is Harmer at? Hama. Okay. And let's use a preset here. Where's the bass at? Analog bass. Holy fuck. Sorry, excuse my language. Okay. Uh, I don't like how they have all this effects on it. Um, okay. Fuck it. Let's use this bass line. So, we got our chords. And the bass is going to really follow 
the chords, right? I do this with every song. I go, I think, what's the, what's the root note? So, and see right there, listen to this. That sounds fucked up. Da da da, you want to be. Da da da. Um, and don't worry, I'm gonna give you some tips to uh, train your ear a little better. And trust me, it's gonna help a lot, and it's easy. Um, okay. Oh, and uh, oh, that's fine. And if you're ever not sure, oh, did I get the note right? Like, for example, it's getting low in the register here. Listen to this. It's hard to even know what that note is, right? What you can do is, let's say you don't know. You can't tell from your ear. Select the note itself, hit Control plus. That brings it up an octave, and now you can hear it better. You can hear, okay, that is a G, right? But I don't want to go that high, so I'm going to go down, control, uh, down arrow key. Up arrow key, down arrow key. And, uh, oh shit, I didn't want to do that. Okay, so what do we got here? Bah, 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 bah. You know what, these pads, I think I'm gonna, just so it sounds a little less robotic, let's see. This is like a, you know, learn to recycle song or some shit. <laughs> this song sucks. Okay, whatever. You get the fucking point. So, what do we got here? We've got uh, some chords. We've got a really simple bass line, but I'll show you how to funk up the bass line. Or just change it, right? Um, we know this is C because it says C right there. So, you know, you can play around with the octave. The octave is the same note like I just said. You select it and hit control up, arrow key. Um, the octave's the same note, but just higher, and you can do a lot with the octaves for bass lines. Check it out. Uh, I fucked around with this too much. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, is there a preset I can use or something? Or just default? Let's just default it. Is there a reload plugin? No? Oh, it's not a plugin. I forgot. Um, Mm. Okay, cool. That's fine. So here we go. So I'm going to show you how to use octaves, uh, you know, to help form a bass line. You could do something like this. Bop, 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 bop. Or maybe... Bum, bum. Or you could go right on the one, two, boom, boom. Check it out. Da da da.
Now it's a little robotic, right? I mean, it's better than what we had, it's better than just the root note. Um, so you could do maybe, and again, this might be a little, I'm a bassist, I know bass lines, right? So. Da, 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 da. All right, now fuck it, let's see. How about? Oops. And again, right there. That's off. You can't really tell, but if you bring everything up, nah, that's not what you want. You want, nah, oh, sorry. You want, nah, nah. Anyway, it's kind of confusing. See, because I'm not, I'm not vocalizing the notes and shit. So you're like, what the fuck is he talking about? I hope this helps someone, man. Um, okay, so we've got our chords, we've got our mediocre bass line. Let's do a uh, lead melody. And I like to think of leads as vocals. You know, when you think of them like that, they get very melodic. Um, now, what does that mean? So let me show you. Uh, I'll use a different plug in here. Let's see. SAR. Uh, yes, SAR. That's always a good sound to suck in the saliva while you're on mic. Um, Sim synth. Jesus. I'll use. Okay, perfect. I'll use Sim synth. I mean, Citrus. There's a preset in here. It's funky. I used it a million times. Where is it? Is it subtracting basic? Nope. That's not it. There we go, there's my baby. Okay, perfect. And maybe, I'll keep the delay, whatever. You get the idea. Um, okay, cool. Wow, it's yellow? They, oh, what's up, hello. Damn, they changed it. It used to be like purple. Huh. Okay, so, uh, so we've got bump, 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 bump. So for, for leads, you want to do anything that's in the scale. And again, you should probably learn what the notes of the scale is if you can't hear it directly. But I'll show you a bad melody that isn't using your ear, right? Uh, let's just go... Well, let's sing it first. I know you, you probably don't want to sing, but... Let's try that. And if you're wondering, like, damn, how is he doing it so fast? Again, I'm I'm constantly stopping and starting the, you know, the metronome and playback. Um, so when you hear the whole thing, you're gonna be like, oh shit, it's moving. But you can tell I'm, you know, I'm taking a while. Um, okay, so all these notes fit within these chords, but you know, let's say I did something like this. And I'm also, I'm also, I thought of the pattern first. Right? It's very, it's very um, percussive, you know? Um, and this is cheesy as shit. I mean, I've made better songs than this. But like, this would be a melody where you know it's wrong. Okay, check this out. Mm. 
Let's just listen, okay. I mean, that's it. You, you should be able to tell that that is discordant with the rest of the song. You know? Like, you should know just by listening to it. Ugh, that sounds like bad. You know? Um, so, it really helps just to try to identify that kind of stuff. Now, I don't know if I should keep going here, but basically, in order to train your ear, um, what I did when I was like 15 was I, okay, G Unit, right? I was listening to G Unit, Lloyd Banks, Tony Ayo, 50 Cent, all those fucking dorks. And I love their music, and some of those beats are still fire. I can't even, I can't even lie. So, I was like, yo, I want to make a track like that. So I would go home on FL Studio 8, I think it was, and try to recreate their songs, their beats, by listening. Listen. So I listened to those melodies like tons of times, dude. Like um, 21 Questions. You know what I mean? And I would copy it. And I would, the finished product sounded like, fucking garbage it should i mean because you don't have all those skills yet i didn't uh of how to shape sounds and what sounds good and blah 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 but you so my main advice is really just listen to the songs that you like or melodies that you love and um you know study them like listen to them slowly keep you know on youtube you can go to the playback thing and slow it down um, but do that shit, man, because it'll help a lot. And then in FL, try to copy the melody, you know, try to copy the chords they're using, sing them out. Um, I wish I had better examples and I don't want to play music because I think I'll get a copyright or content strike or some stupid shit. But, uh, yeah, so that's really like, that's how I learn. And then now don't release that song like, yo, check out this track I made. Cause I mean... <laughs> then you're a fucking thief, right? You don't want to do that. But it is good practice to try to remake these beats. And then you're going to you're going to learn. Like you're going to get it. Uh eventually you're going to be like, "Okay, these chords work. This does not work." Um okay, this melody is cool. Like listening to this track right now, that well first of all, this is not a track I would ever show anyone, but check it out. I mean, it's just so basic. It's so, fuck this, it's trash, you know? You want something, I mean, you want to get to the point where you can do this. And I'm going to show off a little bit to let people know I'm not a complete scrub. Because I bet you're thinking like, damn, this dude's ass. Why is he teaching me about, you know, mel melodies and shit? Okay, so without really, well, maybe you'll learn something. Okay, so... Ooh, you know what? The fucking polyphony. So that's another topic I should get into one day. Wow, really? Okay. So something like this. And what BPM are we at? 92. Let's bring it up a little bit. Yeah, buddy. Boom, boom, bam, bam. I still sing it out loud in my head. I need to figure out FL's... Uh, it feels like the piano roll. <laughs> I'm like, yo, watch this. You're going to learn something. And I'm like, yo, I need to figure this out. <laughs> uh, okay. Boom. How about... Boom. There we go. All right.
Hmm. Uh oh. Pulling the fast one on me. Okay. And you know what? Just another tip is try to make it varied. Like take the same thing you just did, make another pattern, click on it, uh, click on make unique. I don't know if it's showing up on my thing, but do that because otherwise it's going to sound repetitive as fuck and boring. You don't want that. How about this? Sounds whack as fuck. Um, um, there we go. See, these are fucking me up, these notes here. Let's try that. Oops, you know why? Okay, this is a slide note. You can see if you click on it, there's a little slide, so it's actually not really a note at all, it's empty. So that's what fucked me up. Okay, let's check out these chords. I don't like these, but whatever. Nah, I can fix him. Yeah, I need to fix him. See, you you also got to be perfectionist. You can't settle for nah, that's good enough. Um.
How about let's do happier? How about this? And just to spice it up. And fuck, let's do some drums. Why not? I'll use some shitty Lindrum. Not shitty, but... tough to make these sound good. Uh, these were like, dude, the Lindrum, these were like cutting edge. They do sound good, but not really for this genre. Um, so here we go. Take this, take that shit off. Okay. Let's get some trap shit in here. Uh, not vintage. Where you at? Where you at, Lowe's? At... No, no, no. Okay. Wow, this video is going to be 100 years long. Where are we at? 38 minutes? Ah, oh, fuck it. You got to know this shit. Fuck it. Okay. What the fuck? Yo. Okay, you hear that, right? And then I put it in here. What? What's going on? Oh my god. These are some weird drums. Hmm. And uh, hopefully this shit is entertaining to you guys. I would hate for it not to be. That would suck. Oh my god, just do it. Okay, uh, let's do quarter step. Uh, you can select how much you want to chop it here, and then Control U and bam. Damn, that's fire. But you know these drums don't really fit at all for. This kind of like trap thing, whatever this is. I don't know what this is. Uh, one shots. Let's try. Let's get a better kick in there for one. I like this now, actually. I was just fucking around, but. Uh, that's kind of cool. Hmm. I need a more trap. Where's my shit? I have not made beats in forever. Okay, getting there. Good enough, fuck it. Kick hard. Okay. And we need a we need a way better snare. Fuck that snare. Ooh, I kinda like that. For like a weird effect.
These are dope. I never used these. Oh shit! I'm gonna use that, but not as my main snare. Good enough. Okay, and hi hat. Gotta change out that whack hi hat. Oh my god, what happened? Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> I don't know who David is. Wow, do I have to pee right now? I'm almost about to finish this beat. Nope, time to pee. Did I already switch out the hi-hat? Oh, I did. Oh, we're good. Okay. Okay, how about the first pattern? We'll have that little weird snare thing. Bop, 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 something like that. Uh, this one. How about... Okay. Uh, what we got? Bam! Ba da ba da ba 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 ba. Ba na 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 da da da. Uh. Da 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 da. Da na 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 da 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 na. I don't know about those chords at the end. Uh, let's get some dope shit in there. I think you can't even see me on this menu, probably. Uh, fuck it, I'm using my boy Wasp. I hope one day Image Line can fucking figure it out, dude, and get my boy back. And yes, I am assuming Wasp's gender. It's a man. I hope more producers, you know, I try to not show everyone everything, but I hope more producers jack wasp from me, you know, because ah, it's dope and more people should use it. Hmm. Oh, let's make this mono. You see, you hear what I'm doing? You hear what I'm fucking doing? Call this lead, and I'll make it hot pink. That's not sus. Okay. Uh, control L, put you on the master. Go to my vocal thing. I've been putting my instruments on their own vocal bus since I don't have vocals right now, and it's working out pretty well. Uh, let's put everything on the fucking mixer. Um, no, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, cool. And we'll put everything on drums. All the drums on drums. So, as you can see, I did stumble a little bit with the, uh, whatchamacallit, um, with some of those chords and shit, but I mean, you know, that's a lot faster than most people. Um, and it's all from my ear and I knew when it was wrong. That's, you know what I mean? That's the big thing. Like some guys, they have no idea when their melodies are, are fucked. And I, I understand cause it's kind of a skill. I, I you know, I, I want to say, Oh, I'm just using my ears, but it is, you got to know what sounds right. Um, what sounds really off. What sounds good. And you need to have a... This is going to sound so pretentious. You need to have a musical vocabulary, right? Uh, there's tons of songs I've borrowed little riffs from. Not enough to get me sued. Like, oh, I don't know, like Cool in the Gang or fucking Michael Jackson. Little, little things like, you know, that you just use. You know when to use them. And uh, it helps a lot. Okay, what do we got? Oh, you know what? Let me... Put fruity flanges on this guy. 
I'm sure my microphone sounds like booty, but I can't do anything about that right now. Mm, okay. Ooh! That sounds fat. Let's bring the reverb down a lot, though. These are for the chords. You know what? Ooh, that sounds kind of dope. And then on this one, we can use flanges again, but we'll use the other preset. I really like this deep chorus effect. Oh, you can't hear it yet. It's all good. Oh, I haven't done the melody yet. I'm so stupid. Okay. So here's what I'm hearing in my head. Da 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 da. Um. Nope. A little trick, if you want like that little guitar like like slide up kind of thing, you can uh I don't know if everyone's FL Studio does this. If you hit backspace for me, it should take you off grid. So what you can do, get on grid. And do the note under it by, na, 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 I guess two semitones. And then hit backspace. And then you get this effect. Not effect, but you know. Ba, ba. See, it sounds just good. It's pleasing. And if you want, no one's going to fault you for this. If you want to do it again. Boop. You know, you select it, uh, hit shift, click, and drag. And uh, for real, um, what do you call it? Well, let me finish this first. I'll get into that. Da -da 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 -na -da -da. Oh, is my mouse crapping out? No, 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 no. Also, I forgot to mention this, but for leads, a really cool thing is to put it on mono, and that way only one note plays at a time, and you control here the slide of how much it slides. So, for example... See what I'm saying? If I take it off, it's gonna sound like shit. Listen, not shit, but. They're, they're, all the notes are overlapping. You want it on monophonic, so only one note plays at a time. Just to switch it up. Meow. Nope. Okay. Uh, what do we got here? I don't like... You know what? I'm going to copy this a little more. Or just... Another thing is knowing um, how notes, like how long a note is held and not held is so important. Because think about it, I've got the keyboard here. That sounds so different from, wait, so. And then. I mean, you can tell that it, you know, one is really staccato and short, and the other is long and blah, blah, blah. So in your head, you're going to have to figure that out. I want a little harder attack. Ooh. Uh, here 
we go. And uh, I'm an R&B guy. So this is going to sound like a fruity R&B song kind of. But all these things I'm I'm showing you work for any genre, it doesn't matter. And that right there, na 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 na. I mean, I got to do something to that or it's going to sound it's going to stick out like a sore thumb, you know. Maybe a slide down. House is acting up. Okay. No, 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 no. Another trick is repeating patterns. Like, I could do that, or I could go. Two here for oscillator one. Woo! Okay, sorry. <laughs> I gotta stop doing that. And I think this controls oscillator two. I forget. Who cares? Um, I was gonna show you create automation clip, and then for like this line over here. Check this out. Right there. I want that to be sexy. Because uh, right now it's just sticking out like a sore thumb. So I'm going to make some points here. Control points, whatever these things are called. And uh, fucking... Can I... Oh, there you go. I'm really bad at automation, honestly. But I think I'm doing okay here. This is pretty cool. Why is this... Nope. Okay. Let's <laughs> hear this. And you see how I'm auditioning it so many times to get it right, you know? It's not like, bam, I did it in one take, you know? Or take, you know what I mean? This uh, adjusts the stereo separation, kind of helps with widening the track, like aspects of it. Like these are the chords, obviously. Okay, so how about this? How about, uh, let's go. Oh, no, 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 don't wanna do that, sorry. How about for an intro, something real? This is a, I call this the Pharrell Williams. Uh, it might make sense to you, it might not. Mm, one, two, three, four. Okay, so I, what I did is I chopped up the whole, well you just saw me do it. I hope you saw me do that. Um, and you know, my bad for not being a little more technical. There's a lot of guys on YouTube that really know their stuff. And I'm kind of like, so then I did this, <laughs> you know, so my bad. But here. Yeah, 
You know what? You heard, you might have heard, listen to it again. The notes are overlapping. So what I should do is go in here, hit backspace so that it's on none. It's like slip in Pro Tools. Yeah, let's try that. Oops. Um, this beat's getting somewhere, actually, but uh, I want to add a little more to it, if you don't mind. I mean, you're watching anyway, right? Fuck it. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. I think I want, like, a little... Something like, yeah, some little... Little light. Oh, I know. Citrus, here's another trick, not a trick, but if you have citrus, uh, open it up, make a new one, of course, go to presets and find, I think it should be under pianos, Rhodes, find the Rhodes preset, I think it's under piano, I don't know if you can see that screen, beautiful fucking preset, and I usually take off this weird phaser thing. Make it dry as shit. And I make sure the release is really tight. I'll be honest, I'm not a huge Citrus guy. I've used it here and there. It's I know it's a great plugin, but uh, I don't know it that well. But anyway, okay, cool. So we'll call this Rhodes, put it here, bada bing, bada, boom, okay. I'm using my own reverb, it's not my own, but it's it's a plug-in, I'm using it on its own bus. I don't know if I've made a video about that yet, but that's an important thing too. Okay, where are we at here? So I was thinking here, on this bar, or the second half, these little pianos will come in. Check it out. Okay, check this out. Let's see. Bop, 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 bop. And if you want, we can actually just take these chords and fuck with them. Here. Go to pattern 10. Go to roads. Uh, this will save you a lot of time, too. Yeah, I do this a lot. This isn't a noob trick. Take out the slides that I put in there. Hit control A. Check it out, check it out. Shift, click, drag, shift, click, drag. Hold, you know how much time this is saving me? I mean, if I was, oh, actually, you know what? <laughs> wait, wait, <laughs> I fucked up. Okay, whatever. At least for these two, we got it, okay, so. Hmm, it sounds a little too, ro whoa, easy, easy. Sounds a little robotic, actually. Um. Oh, I'm so stupid. Velocity. We can always adjust velocity. Let's try that. Oh my god, my mouse! My mouse is being a hater. Dude, it's cutting out. Well, not that much. All right, almost there. How about something like this? No, 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 how about that? Um, okay, you know, honestly, my mouse is starting to crap out here. I don't know why. I think I need new batteries or something. I just put them in, though. But it's making me... Yeah, it's not working with me. Okay, guys, and I bet this video is a thousand years long. Whew, an hour and one minute, not too bad. I thought it was longer. Okay, so listen. I hope this was helpful to somebody. I apologize if it is not technical enough or if it's just like, oh, do the thing. I know, I get it, trust me. It's frustrating, 
But um, hopefully this helps somebody, and hopefully you get to the point where you're just shitting out jams like this. Those are my hot <laughs> bars. Okay, that's enough. I'm embarrassing myself. Uh, let me know what you think. If this was a good tutorial, if you hated it, let me know as well. Please let me know. I care about that more. And uh, yeah, that's it. See ya.